Welcome to another episode of Kamal Tech Vlog. In today's episode, we'll be doing some cable management. As my cables are very rubbish, I'll be showing you that in a second, like how bad my cable management is. We are going to improve that. And these are the normal desks which I'm using for that. And we are not using any specialized desk or anything. It is a below the desk, the cables are just hanging and we will be able to go ahead and do something about it. I'll show you those cables in a minute. And but for this, what we'll be using is the first and foremost, we'll be using a cable rack like this. This comes out 300 rupees on Amazon. And uh, it's very simple to adjust. And it's a 22 slot cable rack. You can pass through the cable and it can be attached like this below your table. And as you can see, my table is brown in color. So this will go well with it, underneath it. And those cables will not be seen. And the second one, what we'll be using is a cable organizer sleeve. It's by Gizga, uh, for which I use the products always. So these are the sleeves for Gizga. It comes with the holes. I just got two sleeves of 96 centimeters. That's more than enough. And you can wrap many cables and there are many slots through which the cables can be brought out when it's going towards down to connect to your CPU or to connect to your computer or to your anything, any other device. The third component is nothing but uh, these are sticky trolleys. That's what I call it. I don't know what they are. It's actually called. It's all written in Chinese and it's not even 200 bucks and you get five pieces for that. So what it does is one side is uh, uh, fully taped over here which can be attached under your table and the other side can be attached to your junction box or anything like that and the junction box can be put in the side of the table or underneath the table or behind these drawers anywhere you want to go ahead and do that simple as that so that none of the cables or junction boxes are seen uh, which look ugly actually and then you have this Gizga uh, I, I hope you are able to see this properly this is the Gizga uh, wraps that is nothing but uh, Ah, these are loops, uh, loop straps, each are 100 centimeters over here and these are nothing but uh, velcro ones so you, you can go ahead and cut it and use to strap the table strap your uh, cables also and the last but not the least uh, you also have a normal USB 3.0 junk and in extension cable and uh, 2.0 USB cable for your USB this thing this is for uh, connecting any pen drive or anything I can attach it under the desk over here by using a double sided tape do remember get a double sided tape also because that will be useful for us because we are not going to use any screws because this is a normal computer table if you use screws your table will get screwed majorly so better use the double sided tape which can be removed over time and double sided tape is nowadays available or strong also and we will also be going ahead and using these straps to go ahead uh, this is something by the normal zip ties for thick cables for small cables everything we will be using this and as I told you I will be showing you the uh, cables below I will just go ahead and do that Okay guys, so this is my computer screen now and from above you can see the cables, how bad they are on the table on the side how they are hanging over this side how it's hanging it is bad and we'll just go below see here, it's that bad even though I have all the zip ties and everything connected, it looks bad Let's go behind the computer and check how is the condition over there also. Because our whole plan is by using all this stuff over here, we are planning to first go ahead and clean all this <laughs> wires. 
and then we will beautify the desk also that will be on my second part i'll be beautifying the desk so let's see behind the computer so i'm just going over so if you can see behind it's actually very bad let me try getting the okay so the wires are everywhere over here and below it looks very bad there as you can see so we are going to fix that problem now and we will see what we can do for it as you know like this is my normal studio's background i'm recording on a mobile today like so that i can show you what i'm going to do so instead of wasting more time i will get into recording uh, i'll get into fixing these things up and i'll show you each component how i have gone ahead and fixed it for you okay let's start with that okay guys the first step will be to disconnect all these wires from here and from your computer also that is way down over here so we'll be disconnecting everything over here i won't be wasting your time by showing you all the disconnection process but i'll be disconnecting everything so that we can go ahead and put a minimum amount of proper wires and wrap it up so let's go ahead and do that okay guys if you see behind now there are no wires seen except the one wire which you can see over here that is for the ethernet and even that will disappear in some time because we do have to keep the ethernet wire separately and this is the cpu and this cable which you see from here is nothing but a usb cable or a portable usb over here which i'll be fixing it soon and it will be out of sight so it took me about three hours to four hours to complete all this and let me show you the back side also how it looks because of her before you had seen how the back side was looking and now you are seeing how the back side is gonna look because this is the before video how you saw, saw how the wiring was and this is the after video of that and in the side you can see i have mounted the power strip in the side once i move the uh, monitor behind i mean the table behind all the wires and everything from behind will get hidden along with it i have pulled it forward to work on it now so the table is almost empty over here and if you see above there is one wire over here which is connected via the visa mount over here so that it is not seen from this side and even the light is clearly mounted over there without any problem. So if you see here this kind of properly what I have done behind this. So if you see that is the box which I was showing you and those wires will go under the table and it will totally disappear from sight once we push it back. And over here if you see what I have done over here is we will just see the CPU over here. The wires are coming out of the CPU but it's not seen behind because of this velcro strap sleeve which I had bought. I have packed it completely without any problem. And this is the easiest way you can do that. All the wires are connected over here. And even this USB wire will be moving more forward so that it won't be falling down or it won't be seen from front or back. And about where it is mounted. This is the 
check which I told you where I mounted that. There is nothing but a railway tra railway rail through jack for three hundred bucks, which I bought from Amazon. I put all the wires inside that, and it's coming out of the respective holes as it's required. And some of them are coming from here. And if you see here, the HDMI cable goes there directly. Power cable goes there. The same for the other computer also. But the back side is actually very clean than what it was before. So what we'll be doing next is we'll be going ahead and setting up the table and we'll be clearing all the junk and all this junk. And I'll catch you up with, uh, with you in the next video showing you how I'm going to beautify the desk as well as uh, how to keep it clean uh like wire this way like there are loads of wires in this and i have not pasted it or done anything i have not gone ahead and screwed it or done anything i've just pasted it via gum if you see it's holding very clearly over here via gum it's stuck and it won't be coming that soon also out it's as simple as that this is stuck via uh, the double tape which i had bought so please uh, check the next video i will attach it to this video so that you'll be able to check how i'm going to beautify the whole uh, table as it's a normal computer table it's not some fancy table we'll be going ahead and checking how that is done